I've made it a new goal in the last couple of weeks to really try to practice mindfulness and just being present. It's really, really difficult for me. It's not natural for me. I am... Um, have a natural workaholic personality and I don't really like to be a person I like to be a, a doer I like to do stuff um, like work <laughs> so um, every day even if it's only 10 minutes I've been making it intentional on my to-do list to spend time with my sons and today we are at the playground because it is February in Alabama and we are basically having um, a week of summer so we're enjoying it while we can because we know that the freezes will still come back uh, before it's truly summer here. I just went to my favorite thrift store Mission Thrift and I am going to show you what I picked up. So I got these really pretty chairs. See all the detail? They were only five dollars each. I feel like you just can't go wrong. So I'm gonna recover the seats with the new fabric. They're structurally sound. And then um, I'm gonna paint them. That'll be an easy project. I picked up these outdoor patio chairs on uh, Sunday. My friend saw them and she let me know and I went by the trash dump. Uh, it was like a trash pile on the side of the road. And I picked these up. So all I need to do is put some cushions in them and they'll be ready to sell um, people really like this chippy chippy look so I don't need to paint them or anything like that I also picked up this beautiful ornate gold frame so I will just take the glass and the art out and uh, you can see I only paid six dollars I'll take the glass and the art out and just sell the frame by itself. So I've already prepped this frame. I just took the glass out and I've priced this by itself. And instead of throwing this away, I thought I would just go ahead and put a low price on it. So if someone needs a piece of glass for a frame that they already have. And I went ahead and cut out the fabric for three pillows I'm gonna sew. I've got this one, this one, and that one. I love this outfit that I'm wearing. I um, am now doing what Carol Tuttle calls dressing your truth. I took her free course online at liveyourtruth.com and I now am dressing the way that I've always wanted to dress. And it's just an awesome course. You figure out which of the four types you are, what it's like what she calls energy profiling. And then you just start dressing the way that you're um, energy type um, wants to dress I guess is the best way to say it so I would have never worn something like this before I got this really like what I call bold and flamboyant blazer and I love it and I also love this gold chain and I am wearing these cool brand new shoes I got at the thrift store for only three dollars Hey Emmett. And um, it's awesome. So go take her course because it's free and you get to learn how to just truly embrace who you are and not to see your characteristics as flaws, but to really know who you are, who God created you to be, and to know that he didn't make a mistake, that um, those flaws that people think are um, negatives about you, they're actually really beautiful, unique qualities that God put in you for a reason. Emmett and I are here at um, Target and Hobby Lobby. Say hi, Emmett. Hi. Up here. Hi. <laughs> so we came over here to buy a giant canvas. We got a three foot by four foot um, canvas from Hobby Lobby. And yes, I used the 40% off coupon. And um, today we're going to do a fun art project for my friend slash client's dining room. And the kids are going to help me paint. So you guys will see the fun of that next. I have just now prepped this large canvas for hanging. I added these D-rings on each side. And I'll use these picture hangers to hang them in the drywall. And in a couple hours... 
I'm going to have five or six kids helping me paint this into a beautiful blue abstract painting. So I'll show you the after when we're done. My husband has been working hard all day on trimming the rose bushes, building that beautiful um, firewood built holder, and um, now he's burning some fire in the fire pit with the boys, and it looks like they're having a lot of fun. Now my plants are planted in their beautiful blue and white china pots. My husband did this for me this afternoon. Be careful, only on the painting.